don't miss any content don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell welcome back to the channel as usual i am your host selassie if you so it's no time for hypotheticals now last week i brought you two videos uh, two videos talking about the probable starting 11 versus south africa should we have locally based players and also the probable starting 11 should we have both foreign and local players available for the games and uh, i gave you my lineups and now on friday or i think on thursday evening the final list was out and uh, ck akono called uh, 29 players in all nine of them uh, being locally based players and uh, a lot of debutants in there and approximately eight uh, debutants now today i'm going to give you my lineup that i think ck akono will pick ahead of the south africa game on the 25th of uh, March. Uh, that's uh, next week. I uh, think on Wednesday uh, we will know who uh, will be in the starting lineup for the Black Stars. These are no hypotheticals. We now know the members of the squad for real. And these are the players that I think Sika Kono will start with in the game versus South Africa. The game will be played in South Africa and the Black Stars will travel out to the country on Tuesday. Now the Black Stars B also uh, Ibrahim Tanko called a 20-man squad. They will also play a friendly with Uzbekistan with a Wafu games also set to take place in Nigeria as well as the qualifiers for the Chan 2022 or 2023 depending on how tight the calendar is in 2022. But uh, we are going to look at the starting 11 probable starting 11 based on one or two factors which I'll be giving to you as and then I need the players. For the goalkeeping position, I think uh, Richard Ofori will maintain his number one spot. Yes, he has suffered an injury uh, versus uh, ESETIF in the CAF Confederations Cup. But I think CK Akono would want to remain with his number one short stopper. Raza Kabalora has shown to be more than competent. But uh, we have to know that CK Akono's favorite is always Richard Ofori. And Richard Ofori has been delivering. If the injury return is too close to the start of the game, I think that is when Abalora stands a chance to start. But I think for this one, Siki Akono would go with Richard Ofori in the number one spot. In the left back position, Abdul Baba Rahman. He called up two full backs in the left back position in Baba Rahman and Gideon Mensa. Baba Rahman, I think, will start ahead of Gideon Mensa owing to the fact that he has more experience with the Black Stars and also he is the better player between the two, that is him and Gideon Mensa. So I'll go for Baba Rahman at left back. I would have wanted Imore Ibrahim here, but he is in the Black Stars B. That is also playing a game in the same week, so it's understandable why his name was omitted from the squad. Now, there were a lot of talks about Ike Akono calling up a player from a fourth tier English team when we have players here in this Ghana Premier League who are much more competent or equally competent well that player has now been moved on into the Ghana Black Stars B I don't know why that is I have heard I, I, it just baffles me but it is what it is and that's the decision that has been taken a Black Stars B being composed of a foreign base player well um, we'll have the inquest into that in the end now Ben Singh Anan will be a right back for me he called up two players Philemon Bafo and Ben Singh Anan Philemon Bafo this being his debut I would have loved for him to start but Ben Singh Anan on his last time out in that Qatar friendly did himself a lot of good he played well a right back so I would think he'll continue in that position um, uh, CK Akono I would want to see him there he was not available in the qualifiers in november double header with sudan but he will be available and he will be in the starting lineup i think for this game versus south africa in the center of defense i'm going for nicolas opoku and kasim adams yes nicolas opoku and kasim adams would not have been my two favorite as i said i would have wanted joseph edu or mohammed salisu or joseph edu and uh, Kasim Adams uh, probably would have been also another uh, good uh, combination or if Jonathan Mensah was available the MLS season has started and uh, he is back in training with his team so I think uh, this will be the starting 11 Nicolas Opoku of Amiens and Kasim Adams of Hoffenheim 
a wall play in the center of defense here for the Ghana Black Stars. Mubarak Wakasu will be in midfield along with uh, Kudus Mohammed, in my opinion, Wakasu. The most experienced player in the Black Star squad right now, Jian Sing Suning, a player. I'm expecting him to lead the line and to captain the side in central midfield. Kudus Mohamed coming back to play for Ghana as for the first time since November 2019 when he made his debut and scored in that game, coming on as a substitute versus you know who South Africa. So probably uh, he will find the back of the net in this game here once again versus South Africa. I think Kudus Mohamed and Mubarak Wakasu in midfield will be great. At the left side of midfield, I would go in for Joseph Esso. Yes, Joseph Esso is a Dreams FC player and he has gotten a call up to the Ghana Black Star squad for the very first time, if I'm not mistaken. He used to be with the Black Stars. He took part in the Wafu 2019. And unfortunate for him that the Wafu tournament did not go according to plan. Ghana lost the Wafu competition and uh, he and his teammates had to regroup. He is in the Black Stars team now. Kamau Soa, another debutant. I expect him to right, make it have a run out at work for the Ghana Black Stars in his position at the left side of this team. So it's a 4 4 2 formation that i'm going for in this in this team this lineup i'm calling out come out on the left joseph Esso on the right in the middle will be kudus mohammed and mubarak wakasu up front i would go for emmanuel boating yes emmanuel boating a dalian pro player and the chinese super league has his issues recently but i think emmanuel boating with his experience uh, will be great for the team Kwame poku would have been a great starter for me but I don't think CK Akono will start Kwame Poku, who has secured a move to USM all years. And uh, I don't know. I think Kwame Poku will sit on the bench and probably come in. And the second striker I would have in there is Khaled Ekuban uh, for the Ghana Black Stars. Khaled Ekuban uh, will be partnering up uh, with uh, Khaled, with Emmanuel Boateng up front. So this is my starting 11 for the Ghana Black Stars versus South Africa on 25th of March. Uh, it will be Richard Ofori, Baba Rahman, Ben Singh Anan, Nicholas Opoku, uh, Kasim Adams, uh, Mubarak Wakasu, uh, Kudus Mohammed, Joseph Esso, Kamal Sowa, Caleb Ekuman, and Emmanuel Boateng. So these are the players that I feel will start the game. Let me know what you think from this pool of players that have been called up. 28, if you factor in the fact that the Colchester player has been moved on to the Black Stars. We on the 20, a 28 man squad that has been called up by CK Akono. This is my starting 11. Your thoughts in the comments box. I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a great day. Enjoy your weekend.